everyone. I've seen a lot of videos of people posting their DNA results here on YouTube using the two most popular companies, 23andMe and Ancestry.com. I thought this would be a fun thing to do since my mom was adopted and I virtually know nothing about her biological side of the family. I decided to send samples to both companies and then compare the results. When my DNA results were finished, I was excited to see where my ancestors originated from. I want to start off first with 23andMe and then go on to Ancestry.com, followed by a side-by-side -side comparison of both of them. Here's the 23andMe, and this is the basic map of my ancestral composition. I really did not know what to expect when I first viewed the screen. I knew my paternal ancestors came from England, and everything else was kind of a mystery. I was pretty surprised, 0.8% uh, Sub-Saharan, and also 0.1% East Asian, specifically Japanese. My wife came to the U.S. from Japan, and this kind of brought up a red flag. My family's always lived in the Midwest, so the chances of having even a minute amount of uh, Japanese is pretty improbable. I think there could have been a possible cross-contamination. My wife did handle the sample right before we sent it. Okay, now onto the Ancestry.com site. I think this estimation is a little bit closer in relation to what I do know about my family. I have an English surname, and Ancestry.com has me about 31% British versus 16% 23andMe. Okay, now let's compare the results side by side. 23andMe is on the right side, Ancestry.com is on the left. Both of them say I'm about 98% European. They differ a decent amount at which areas of Europe I'm from. For instance, Ancestry.com has me at 11% Scandinavian versus 0.4% for 23andMe. Ancestry.com then goes on to say that I have no African background, whereas 23andMe said I was about 0.8%. Ancestry.com Ancestry also says I have no Jewish background. 23andMe says I was about 0.2%. Both of them agree that I have less than 1% Asian. Uh, Ancestry.com said I'm of South Asian descent, and uh, 23andMe said I was about 0.1% Japanese. But like I said earlier, I kind of question that. Uh, I know the percentage, at least for my European ancestry, can be kind of evened out, but... Uh, due to the generic groupings both sites use, like West Europe for Ancestry.com and non-specific Northern European for 23andMe. So I can kind of even out those percentages on both of them. But for the trace amounts of my other backgrounds, non-European backgrounds, they can't be further off, I think. So I'm not real sure how either site came up with those areas. Anyhow, I did think all this was interesting, and I'm curious if any of you have tried both uh, test and have come back with uh, slightly different results like I have.